Hello everyone, today we are going to stretch out our shoulders. So if you're having any neck tension or shoulder tension, upper back tension, this class is for you. And if you're not already subscribed, I post every Saturday, so hit that subscribe button. Meet me on the mat in a cross-legged position. Spine is long. Reach your left arm behind your back so that the back of your hand is resting on the right side of your waist. You should be able to grab your hand with your right hand. If you're struggling with this, this may be a flexibility issue. Um, you might have stiff muscles, more strength than flexibility. The more you do this, the more flexible your arms are going to be. Now, turn to the right side. Tilt your head down towards your right armpit. Breathe here. Bring your head looking forward and tilt your head so that your ear is reaching towards your right shoulder. And breathe here. Feel that stretch in your neck and your shoulders. Release your jaw and breathe into that stretch. Bring your head back up. And we're going to repeat on the other side. So right arm reaches outward and back. Say hello to your left hand. And turn your head to face your left armpit with a slight tilt of the head. Breathe here. Bring your head back to center and left ear towards your left shoulder. Unclench your jaw. And breathe into that stretch. Now release the stretch and come back to seated with a long spine. Inhale, reach your arms up towards the sky. Bend into your left elbow so that your palm is touching your upper back. 
Using your right arm, place it gently on your left arm, pulling it a little bit so that you feel a stretch. This is not supposed to hurt. And breathe into that stretch. We're going to repeat on the other side. Now release the stretch. Inhale, reach your arms up, bend into your right elbow and use your left arm for support. While we're here, stretch out your mouth. Stretch out those cheeks, just smile and make weird movements, funny movements. Maybe make a kissy face and move it from left to right. This is great for stretching out your cheeks. Now release the stretch and come back to seated. Left arm in front of you, bring it towards the right, take your right arm and bend it into your left arm, creating a stretch, breathe here, And release the stretch, switch arms, and breathe. release your arms place your hands behind you long spine and lean back slight back bend your chest is reaching towards the ceiling come back to seated slight back bend again chest is reaching towards the ceiling look up And come back to seated. Place your fingers on your shoulders. We're going to do one of my favorite stretches for the shoulders. So now bring your elbows forward to touch and touch your wrists at the back of your head. 
while trying to maintain a long spine looking forward. Bring your elbows forward and touch your wrists at the back. As you do this exercise, pay attention to your back, upper back muscles. Now again in a circular motion, bring your elbows forward to touch. Inhale and exhale through this exercise. Continue at your own pace. And release. Whew, do you feel the tension? This is all going to feel really good later. So now we're going to do the same thing except in the opposite direction. So now wrist touch, bring it forward, elbows touch, bring it back. And wrist touch behind you, elbows forward, bring it back, wrists elbows let's go so 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 two, and one. Whew. Now, palms on your thighs, knees. We're going to do circular motions with our shoulders. So right shoulder, circular motion backwards, And circular motion forwards and now the left shoulder backwards breathe into this and then forward Everybody now. I hope you're all stretched out. We have a few more. So now come into tabletop position. Send your hips to touch your heels in child's pose. Touch your palms together. Bend your elbows. Fingers pointing towards the ceiling. Feel that stretch in your shoulders and arms. Breathe here. Release your arms onto the mat and then lift them back up. Palms touch. Now come back onto your hands and knees and lower your entire body down, belly flat on the mat. 
Extend your left arm away from your body. Using your right hand, plant it on the mat as you push into it, turning your body, chest opens towards the right side of the room, stretching out your left arm. Bend into your right knee, plant the sole of the foot on the mat, left leg is extended. Breathe here. You have the option to reach your right arm and try to touch your left arm. You can try to interlace your fingers for a deeper stretch. And if that is not accessible, then you can just place it behind you or in front of you like it was before. Breathe into the stretch. And then roll over on your belly again, releasing your body onto the mat. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. So reach your right arm away from your body. Use your left hand to push onto the mat and turn your body onto its side. Lengthen your right leg as you bend into your left leg, sole of the foot on the mat. You can feel free to stay here. Or if you'd like a deeper stretch, reach your left arm behind you. Try to grab a hold of your right hand. If you can't do that, that's okay. Just bend into your um, left hand and just place it gently behind your back. Breathe into the stretch. Now roll back onto your belly. Press into your palms as you lift your chest up. Left arm reaches towards the right side of the room. Right arm reaches towards the left side of the room under your chest. Creating a stretch, rest your chin on your right arm. If you need any extra support for your head, feel free to put a pillow in front of your forehead. Breathe here. And then we're going to switch hands. Now, your right arm goes under as you reach towards the left side of the room. Left arm reaches towards the right side of the room. Right arm is above the left. Breathe here.
And when you're ready, press into your palms and come to tabletop position. Knees are under your hips, hip width apart. Start to walk your hands forward into puppy pose as you lower your chest and forehead onto the mat. Breathe here. Now pressing into your forearms, lower your hips onto the mat as you lift your chest proudly, look forward, sphinx pose. And pressing into your forearms again, lift your hips off the mat and back into puppy pose. Breathe here. Now start to send your hips back to touch your heels, pulling your upper body into child's pose. Palms touch, bend into those elbows, fingers pointed towards the ceiling. Breathe here. All right, now gently make your way into a seated position. Palms together, close to your heart. Take this time to reflect on this practice. How does your body feel? Thank yourself for bringing yourself to the mat and prioritizing your health. Thank you everyone for joining me and have a great rest of the day.